hello good morning friends if you'll go uh, for my previous video we can see i have given a lot of topics on protocol testing okay as per request by some of our uh, subscriber i came with that wireshark tool understanding on english okay let's go for wireshark tool understanding okay why we are using and what is the use okay so this is a very important tool if you go for any type of protocol testing in telecom domain so always we are going to use the wireshark okay if you go for qxdm tool if you go for analysis or if you go for the factor factor capturing for this cases we are using that wireshark okay we can act this uh, format will be we can uh, format if you go for uh, that log capturing of wireshark then it is coming under pcap logs it will come okay dot pcap so you can see we can download from anywhere if the open source uh, packet analyzer this one wireshark is a free open source packet analyzer you can use for the network troubleshooting analysis software and communication protocol development and education purpose or for collecting to capture the network packets and display them in a granular levels okay means we can say if you go for the protocol testing okay so protocol testing if you go for l3 testing or data throughput testing or handover testing you collect this logs from might we have collected from qxdm or you have another, another tools and if you want to analyze then you can analyze from here or if you want to capture network logs or telecom any tech telecom logs then you can use this wireshark for your analysis okay this is the free free uh, tool you can use it so this is the one benefit from wireshark is we can use this tool as a real time or offline for an offline analysis also we can do it if you want to use this tool for the real time network you can use it if you want to already collected logs if you want to analyze then we can use this wireshark so here we can see here i have given here how to download the wireshark just to go to that steps one by one steps okay it's a given here in the download and down and downloading page of wireshark just to go to wireshark page and download it as per your two flavors window 32 or 64 bits pick the correct one as per your os uh, as per your operating system just to pick it and download it after downloading just say it's already given in the steps in the uh, uh, steps in the website just go through it and after downloading you will see this screen if you go for downloading and up installation you have done then you will see this type of window you will see on the on your screen after downloading and installation so we can see here there is a file edit view go capture analyze statics telephony wireless tcp uh, tools and helps okay this is if you go for the recording purpose if you want to go for the recording just the first option you can see here i will show you here there is a, and this is the button for capturing the packets okay once you will uh, might be you are using the mobile for testing you have connected this uh, somewhere and from there if you want to capture the logs or you want to use the, and you are collecting the networks packets which is coming and going so we can start capturing on the real time okay if you want to analyze your logs which is collected from the wireshark in the offline or might we have collected from the different tools just you have to convert your your file in the pk format and from the pk format we can go for the analysis from this tool so here we'll go for a file and open the file wherever your pickup file is there just open it and it will show a three window it will show just like this one uh, this is the starting only they have come and you will see this like this is the pickup i have given one example i have shown you this will be look like this a dot pickup files will be mostly common used here okay if you'll open if you'll open this file just to go to file and open it if you'll open it then you will see three windows will it will be open one be packet list which is coming and going okay as you can see here source and det destination and protocol type what is the length and information you will get it okay a time also including the time in second one you can get the packet details and last one you can get the packet bytes okay just if you scroll one by one as per your source and destination or protocols related you can filter just you can see here left side uh, option left side there is one option showing filter option just you can go write that your tc uh, your protocols name and you filter it you will get that same uh, filter uh, same tcp list on packet list from there just if you want to click one by one you can get the in the middle one you can packet details you will get the details of every packets means if you can see here 12 packets are there if you click one by one you will get the packet detail just you have to extract one by one you will see that 
uh, we can see that packet det uh, packet details what is there okay from here only we are going for analysis so first window we can see this on this window we can see these are the menus okay second one you can say once you open your pk files it will be coming here with the including the packet list and duration destination everything information and from here if you go for for what is there inside the packet list we can get the packet details and this is the packet bytes that is not required if you go for analysis but most, mostly these two are important for checking your logs okay this is the means if you are getting any packet logs from we can get packet pk log if you if you don't have pk logs just to go to go to google or from google you can get uh, get some pk file already some people already uploaded on the google okay just to take one google pk files and open here in the washer and see that what is there in that uh, protocols okay you can see that all the protocol list uh, what what is happening here you can just like you can see transmission protocol here in the, in the transmission protocol you can see a source port it is showing here destination port it is showing and all this information if you go uh, plus button will be there just you click plus on plus button it will, ext it will extend some it will give some other information packet list information you will get here okay just to get from the google and you can analyze and you can see that information all the information on your wire shark here so these are the basic information i have given you In the subscriber who is uh, not able to understand the hindi so i have given this basic information in my hindi videos also if you want any information on the protocol uh, related uh, testing which is related to telecom i am ready to help you already you have to focus on these tools like wire shark linux and, uh, and, and now they are looking for automation you have to go for the python and uh, one more tools if you go for ev testing you have to uh, work on that qxdm tool qcat tools and qpst there's are different tools are there so as per the company standard they are using different different tools okay but this wireshark is most popular and widely used protocol uh, uh, analyzing tools so we have to install it it's a free tool install it analyze some logs just see the views how it look like then it will be easy for you to understand that wire thank you so much if you like then please subscribe and share that